Hey guys, how's everyone? Good to see you all. Today we're just going to see a very interesting segment. Uh, well, it's quite an anxious segment for us. Um, we Just because the sun is out shining in Ireland, like really, really shining bright and beautiful, and being a weekend tomorrow, we decided to take a long trip. Like just a day trip, but quite a long trip. Unfortunately, um, we will not be able to bring Hazel with us because it's it's kind of a three hour drive. So um, we initially thought we will bring her with us. But um, then um, when we consulted her vet, they said like, you know, it is not a good idea because Hazel is not used to that long trip yet because she's still a baby, she's still a puppy, she's only seven months old. So they said it will stress her out because she wanted to, uh, you know, she might need fresh water, she might need to uh, wee if she wanted to, but like, all those will be difficult during travel. So just because it's such a short notice, we couldn't book her into uh, the pet hotel. We have her booked in um, with the SCPA hotel. Uh, but, uh, you know, not for this weekend. They are fully booked for this weekend. So we decided to leave her with her pet minder tomorrow. Uh, a lady called Becky, who lives close by to us, she had kindly offered to mind Hazel for the day. It's going to be quite an anxious uh, day for us because um, we haven't um, we haven't been away from Hazel for that long. Uh, it's going to be like kind of around ten hours, and Hazel is like she's not used to that as well. We kind of um, thought about it for quite a long time, and then we said like, look, well. We'll, we'll, we'll try it, no harm in um, trialing it. Um, to be honest, I think I'm as anxious as I was 12 years back when I had to send my older son to junior inference the, the night before he was due to start a school, like I was this as ang anxious as I am today. It's like a deja vu moment, but I'm definitely sure Hazel is going to be fine. We'll keep you posted, you know, as you see along in the video. So I'm just going to show like what we have prepared to leave with the uh, minder for tomorrow for Hazel. Well, I start with the food. So this is what we have prepared for her food. This is her pellets, like in you know, a Royal Canadian. Uh, so that's two bowls of pellets with um, beef soup, uh, minced beef and soup. This is for her lunch, like around uh, probably around two o'clock, she will have this. Two bowls of Royal Canaan and then um, pellets and then um, the uh, beef, minced beef soup. Uh, it's been boiled, so like, you know, she'll have that. It needs to be warmed, so she'll have that at like around two o'clock. And this is chicken breast pieces. Like, you know, there are two portions. One portion will be given, should be given around like half ten in the morning. Another portion around like, say, uh, three or around like half three in the evening. And then like, you know, this is her treat. Like, she loves dog fillets. So this is her treats um like you know if she is going becky will be bringing her for walks so um this is when she goes for walks or if she is like kind of obeying so this this is the treats and then this is kind of her toys uh, people who follow us like right from the start know this teddy bear uh, it's her favorite toy. It's there since the day she she came home. This is a favorite toy. So we wanted her favorite toys to be with her during the day. And this uh, purple ball, like fetch ball, is another thing. Uh, like this is a new one, but like, you know, she likes the purple fetch ball. Uh, she had dripped probably uh, three or four at this stage. Uh, and this one is like kind of a chewy and she likes that as well. And we have another fetch ball. And just because they are saying it's going to be 27 degrees Celsius tomorrow, um, we are using this cooling pad. Like I know it's quite small. It's not as big as like, you know, that would fit a St. Bernard. Uh, but, you know, um, it, it, it helps in a way. This is a cooling pad, which we will be giving it to the minder as well. 
that's because it's going to be 27 degrees tomorrow like already the last two days it's 25 degrees 26 degrees and hazel is struggling but at home we have a cooler spot for her so it's fine and then like this is her toileting stuff um i'm going to give a few pairs of gloves for her and then this is her uh, poop bag um and this is her toilet mats and obviously antiseptic creams as well or antiseptic wipes as well or sorry disinfectant wipes uh so um i we will be giving the her toileting box like you know um uh, which she is trained to um we and poo so we will be giving the toileting stuff as well so these are the stuff along with this will be we'll be bringing her food bowl and a fresh water bowl because hazel needs fresh water all the time so we have two two big bowls where we will change them quite like after every time she drinks from the bowls because as we all know um saint bernard's drool a lot and i say a lot a lot a lot yes they drool a lot so you know um although hazel is only seven months old still she drools a lot so um she needs uh her water to be changed every time after she drinks that's why we have few bowls at home but for tomorrow for becky um to have hazel for the day we are going to give her two um bowls for fresh water so we're going to see how the day goes and becky had promised us um to keep us in loop for the day like you know she will be sending f photos videos which we will be um adding to this video as we go along and um let's see we are pretty anxious so hazel will be going to becky at around eight o'clock in the morning and the plan is to collect her around a six or by half six um let's see hope everything works out well and we are we have been saying this to hazel like for the last two days since we planned this well yeah i don't know either she understands or not but i think she does uh some she did understand some i think but anyway listen we'll see how things go tomorrow um fingers crossed let's hope for the best